Welcome back to the channel, you amazing crazy people. Welcome back to my channel, True Fight Gaming. Here again, guys, with another video today. We're going to be trying to get the dragon skin. As you know, we have to fight these guys when you're below level 15, but I'm higher than level 15. So I'm going to show you a quick way to get level up really fast and to basically get a load of a bunch of new abilities and things like that. We're going to start by card modding stuff and getting cards. Uh, I've shown you a few of those if you want to see how to get really good cards. Uh, take a look at my guide to the card. Triple Triad guide. Um, it's on my playlist. It's on my best bits somewhere. Um, we want to fight quite a few of these enemies. Take their magics. We've got Blinded Silence here. Obviously there's going to be different types of enemies. And what we're going to do is fight in this one forest until we're about level 35. So that is going to get us the dragon skins off the anacondas. But first, we need to get some decent magic and we need to card mod quite a few things so that we can get HP and all that sort of stuff. So we're just going to power level ourselves to around about mid-level using our specials, using anything we can use, magic, curing ourselves as much as possible in fights, using sleep, using shell, using protect, all that stuff, blind, silent. We're going to be going for as much stuff as we can possibly get, really, to make ourselves pretty much unstoppable. But to do that, we need to level up really fast. Now, the only way of doing that is by doing these three things card modding, the right card mod using the special abilities of your GFs, your summoning material, summoning gods as they are like Ifrit and things like that and you want to be using their skills to modify your magics now by doing that you're going to get much stronger again by defeating different enemies at different levels especially these particular enemies in this forest uh, near timber as you come off the train just as where you were uh, before near Donut there is a forest just before you're going to go there and normally you would be just before level 15 and you try to get it off this one enemy but there are so many other opportunities and why not level up it's easier um, a lot of people used to say back in the day when we first got the game that you'd have to be before level 15 so you could get Skull's ultimate weapon. It doesn't really matter, it's the same thing, you're going in the same direction, it doesn't matter if you level up a little bit. I'm already level 22 anyway so I figured why not uh, get about 8 levels until you're level 30, you're pretty much at the level anyway, it doesn't really take that long whilst you're gathering materials. Now one of the things that I'm going to be showing you uh, to do is basically junctioning properly at some point, um, but uh, you can do that by uh, stealing, well not stealing, but uh, drawing lots of magic and defeating lots of enemies and you're going to get lots of items and these items will help you out. Now what I want you to do is keep in mind that this is just the way I play because I've played it quite a long time. Um, it's just playing it naturally and just drawing all the magic out. Um, it doesn't really take that long. Uh, generally with the new version you can use times three speed. Um, you can use whatever you want to do it but uh, it's actually really easy and fun uh, to do it this way and take the magic that you need and then use the scan um, magic to uh, scan your enemies so you can find out how much HP they've got, how to defeat them, their weaknesses. It's usually a really good idea to figure this out. In this version though, um, you can use card mod on them to change them into the cards as well. Um, in this version you don't really get um, a time limit of how poisoned you are or anything like that. So you can pretty much just attack and use magics and cure because it won't really tick down on damage like poison or something like that. The only thing I would say you can use is probably a echo screen or a awakening so that you can wake your party up from sleep. Usually you can get woken up by an attack so that eliminates that as well. So the only real 
items that you're probably going to need is Phoenix Downs and things like Echo Screens. If you're blind, maybe an eye drop or two. Uh, but there's not many items you do really need. Here's the Anaconda. This is the enemy that we're looking for. We want to kill these in stride. They're going to give us lots of AP and lots of experience. They're going to give us a few items that we can uh, use to get better items as well as they're going to drop the Dragon Skin at level 35. Now I'm quite high level anyway so as soon as I get to level 35 with Skull, that's not going to take me too long, I can get the Dragon Skin and we can be on our way. Now the only reason we're here really is mainly to train up and level up and get our health strong enough so that we can be strong enough to fight the fight, the good fight. So let's go ahead and we're going to go straight to where we're card modding. I'm going to show you how to do that a little bit here and there. It's not really that hard as long as you draw out the magic. You can get Cura and Fyra from this guy, Anaconda. So that means you're going to have some strong magic and you're going to be able to heal yourself right up. So if you're still watching right now, then you know that we've gotten to a certain point in the level, so all we're really looking for is the anacondas. We want to defeat as many of them as possible now and try and get the dragon skin to drop. Uh, the higher the level, uh, the more uh, percentage you're going to be for it dropping, and it's like 8% um, at level 35. So we're at level 24 right now. And we will get to 35 quite quickly. It won't take us that long. It will take us probably 30 to 100 fights. Um, and 20 to 30 fights is nothing at this speed. Times 3 and how we're going, making progress. We're not going to take that long. Um, especially if we're learning quite a few of these abilities. And we're going to be getting quite a lot of magic and things like that. We've got ability free to learn. Things like that so that we can learn some more ability slots. Uh, that's going to help really really good and uh, as you can see that's where we're going to be going next into the garden so that we can escape uh, there's quite a lot of enemies here that we can uh, fight and level up and get quite a, a lot of AP as you can see we've got uh, sleep and blind on as well on Quistis there so every time she attacks she blinds enemy you've got things like that they do quite a lot of damage obviously they're going to scale to your level and they're going to get stronger as well so we're going to be able to use a lot more magic and things like that and specials. So as you can see I'm using quite a lot of specials here. Got a uh, clap, uh, Squall's ability there. 
as you see we still get in the dragon fangs and things like that but we want the dragon skins off the anacondas so it's going to take a while to level up but we will get there eventually gradually And as you can see guys if you are still watching this video we are now level 35 so that means we can probably try and get this dragon skin we've got all the right things we're already on to three to four thousand hp we're doing really good with our levels right now so let's try and get the things that we need to get obviously we're going to get di different items and they're going to be as strong as this and do quite a lot of damage Generally, I can stay all day here. Um, if you've got, like me, managed to pick up some Demi, uh, you can use Demi at this point, and it really is helpful to uh, whittle the fights down. So each time you're fighting, you can find these anacondas, and you can get it done, and you can get the dragon skins, and you can move on. Um, it does take a while to level them up, and obviously because they scale to your level, you're going to level up really fast. As you can see, we're quite high levels now, especially with uh, GFs uh, close to level 30, 35, 40s. So uh, that's really good, actually. And we're getting that much done. And we learnt nearly all of our abilities now. And obviously, we've done quite a lot 
This took me up to an hour or two to get this, especially with uh, times three. You can pretty much complete the game in a day if you're doing it like this. Because pretty much when you get to about, about these levels, you're pretty much overpowered anyway from like level 20 anyway because of the card modding. But uh, I won't go into that, that will pretty much kill you to know uh, some of the things that I know on this game will pretty much make this game nothing compared. To, it'll be so broken, but we're going to try and get these dragon skins now in this fight using Demi to whittle down their health. Hopefully we can get this, and we're going to try and use blind and sleep on them as well. Shouldn't take us too long, guys. We're already at that point where we can uh, do quite a bit of damage. Obviously our weapons are going to do quite a bit anyway because we're high levels. And what we're using here is water as well. Water's really good at doing quite a bit of damage against them. There we go, there's one. Let's try and get the other one. We've almost got it guys, there we go. And we should get the dragon skin on this one. There we go, dragon skin. Thank you for watching guys. I hope you have a wonderful week and I hope you had a great day guys uh, when you're watching this, hopefully. And I will catch you in the next one.